Right now, it's not hard to find a parking spot here at Rocky Vista University. As you can see, the parking lot's pretty empty, but that will all change in just a few short months when the school's first group of students start to arrive. If you've ever dreamed of becoming a doctor, that path typically begins at med school, usually thousands of miles and several states away. But starting in late July, I'm definitely excited. That will no longer be the case. It's something I'll always be able to say that I was the, one of the first medical students in Montana. 25-year-old Justin Palo will be one of the first 80 students to attend classes here at the Montana College of Osteopathic Medicine. Palo grew up in Oregon, but graduated from Montana State University Billings with a major in biology and minor in chemistry. His family and his four-month-old daughter have made Montana home. It wasn't until my interview day that I really decided to stay here. I was very impressed with Dr. Park, the dean. He answered all of our questions and left us with no doubts. He was just very inspiring. Paolo plans to go into primary care and is excited to join the first class. That is really cool. <laughs> RVU MCOM is a private university. The annual cost to attend is around $60,000. According to educationdata.org, that's just below the national average of $65,000 for a private med school. Tuition at public medical schools is closer to $53,000. Just 13 of the students in this school's first ever class are from Montana. I'm excited because I know to some degree I'll be able to help build a, a culture that lasts for future students and I'll be able to be something of a, of, a, of a pioneer to figure out some of those harder things and I'll be able to pass those on to future students. But for now, Paolo is enjoying time with his daughter before starting his journey of becoming a doctor. I'm the full time dad right now. I figure it's something that I'm never going to get to do again in my life. So just taking that opportunity. My wife's a nurse, so she's providing for us while I do that. In Billings, Haley Monaco, MTN News.